Hey guys, it's Brett. And Brett. We're your independent Sensei Consultants. We're here with some sneak peeks of the fall and winter. Fall and winter, start to say spring, fall and winter 2023. So they had Sensei Family Reunion this year, which is a convention for Sensei Consultants. We weren't able to go, unfortunately, but they've been posting pictures all on the internet about it. So I've been like screenshotting all kinds of pictures, saving pictures so I could like talk to, with you guys about it. Some consultants have already put some videos up, but we wanted to share our thoughts on some th of some things that are coming out and then what's coming back to the catalog and what's not coming back and all that stuff. So this might be a long video. We're going to try to like go through here, not like too long, but that never works. So it'll probably be a little bit long, but we'll see. Okay. So first up, lots of good stuff coming out, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, so much. I couldn't believe how much stuff just kept seeing, it kept seeing, it kept seeing. I'm like, gosh, so much stuff coming out. I'm going to have to pick up 10 more days at Quick Trip. Oh, wait, there's only five in a week. I know, right? Lots of good stuff. But, so first up, we're just going to go through, I'm going to read what is coming in the catalog, the scents, the fragrances that are coming into the fall winter 2023 catalog. I'm just going to read through them real quick. We have aloe water and cucumber, Amazon rain. Those usually always come, aren't every catalog, spring, summer, and fall, winter. Apple and cinnamon sticks is back. Apple cherry strudel is back. Arctic kiss is back. Around the campfire, thank goodness, I love that. Mm -hmm. That's so good, love around the campfire. Autumn hearth, autumn road trip, autumn sunset, baked apple pie, that's always in every catalog. Uh, black currant plum, black raspberry vanilla, blackberry spice, which was new last year. Um, all the new fall winter from 2022, they're coming back this fall and winter, which I don't know if that's ever happened before, but every single one of the 10 new ones last fall and winter are coming back in the catalog this fall and winter. Blue Grotto, Blueberry Cheesecake, that's always in there. By the Sea, not quite sure where they bring By the Sea for fall and winter. That to me is a summer scent. I feel like they could have brought other stuff in instead of by the sea, but I guess some people want to have a summery type of scent in the fall and winter, maybe. Candy cane buttercream, that was in the Sensperations last fall. And that one was really light for us, though. That whole collection was pretty light. I know a lot of people said that, and we agree. It was that I liked candy cane buttercream for like an hour or so, and then it just died off, and I couldn't smell it at all. Maybe they reformulated it and it'll be stronger this time because it was a really good scent. It's just so light, could almost couldn't even smell hardly. Caramel apple craze is back. Cashmere and corduroy, cedar cider, Christmas cottage, cider mill, cinnamon bear, cinnamon pine cones. That was December scent of the month. And it came with the warmer retreat or the uh, winter retreat warmer December. We like that. Some people didn't like that scent. It wasn't my favorite, but I I did like it. I did like cinnamon pine cones. I'm kind of I wasn't I'm kind of shocked they brought that back because there were some people that didn't like it. But I guess enough people liked it to where they decided to bring it back. Cinnamon vanilla is back. Uh, clean breeze. Clean breeze. Clothesline. Those are always in every catalog. Clove and cinnamon. Love that. Glad that's back. It's one of my favorites. Coconut lemongrass. Cozy Cardigan, Cranapple Crumble, that was new last year as well, and um, I liked it. Some people didn't. Cranberry and Cardamom, that's new. There, some of these are new too. For There's 10 new scents as well mixed in here with these. Dashing, that's new. Eucalyptus Wreath. Fall Feeling is new. Falling Apples was new last year. Farm Stand Pumpkin, that's back. Um, a lot of people love that one. I struggled with that one last year. I couldn't smell it very well. I didn't get much throw from that. I hope maybe I'll try it again this year. Uh, first day of fall, fluffy fleece, French lavender. I'm kind of surprised that came back. I think that's normally in the spring and summer catalog, I thought. But I think a lot of people, because it came back with that, um, the Epcot collection, and then a lot of people were going crazy, like they wanted it so bad. So I guess they decided to bring it back in the cat for the fall winter because everybody was going crazy about French lavender. We did warm it just recently for the first time because it was one of the uh, wax melt challenge for July that I did. It was, I think, just close your eyes and grab a scent, and I grabbed that one, and I had never warmed it before. But I made the mistake of warming it, and the open concept it was really light. 
we could sum up number, but it was just light. So yeah, it was light in the open concept. I should probably should have done it in a bedroom. I, I knew better than that, but because lavender is a little bit on the lighter side, so I, if you do it, I would probably not do it in open concept. Maybe try it in a bedroom, but it was good, just, just lighter for open concept. Uh, let's see, frosted cedar, uh, I think. Frosted air. Oh, frosted cedar oh, on top. Okay. Uh, I think that's new. I think that was a new one. Frosted vanilla, that came back uh, from last year. It was a new last year. I love that one. Frosty air, I think that's new. Give me candies back. We love give me candy. Oh my god, I love that one. I think almost everybody loved give me candy. Mm -hmm. That was really popular. So there's, I'm, you know, that's not a shock that they brought that back because that was a big, big hit last year. Golden Garland is new. Huckleberry Hideaway, that was new last year. Jammy Time, that's a favorite. Johnny Appleseed, Just Breathe. I think that normally was in the spring and summer catalog before, but they brought it back fall, winter too. But it's really good. We warmed that in our open concept too recently. It's for the first time. We'd had the, like the body wash and um, the pods and some other things, mm -hmm. but we didn't have the wax yet. I tried the open concept. It was so strong. So strong, the open concept. Lemon drizzle cake is back. I like lemon drizzle cake, mm -hmm. didn't you? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of people that don't like lemon drizzle cake. A lot of people are upset that they came back. I don't understand. I mean, I guess people don't like that lilac sugar note. I don't really get that that much. I don't really get the lilac sugar that much. I did the first time I warmed it, but I just warmed it again in the wax melt challenge this month. And it was really good. I really liked it. I thought it was just good bakery, lemony bakery cake scent. But so many people get that strong, they really get that lilac sugar and they don't like it. It's not my favorite. I do think maybe lemon coconut chiffon I do prefer a little bit more, but I still really like lemon drizzle cake. So I'm not mad that they brought it back. Luna is coming back. Make me snickerdoodle. That's new. We'll see how that is compared to uh, the Christmas one, the... St. Knickerdoodle last year in the the sense, sense of the Season collection. Lots of people love that one. It, it was nice. I didn't love it. I don't know. I don't quite get the complete hype of that one. To me, it was just kind of okay. And it didn't last very long for me. I liked it, but it, so many people just love it. We'll see how it make me Snickerdoodle does. Maple Apple Bourbon, Midnight Mahogany's New, Mocha Doodle, Mystery Man, Newborn Nursery, We've never had that before. Mm. Uh, Palo Santo and Cinema's new. Uh, that sounds really good. Perfect Day came back. It was new last year. Perfect Peppermint, Polar Bear Hug, Pumpkin Cinnamon Swirl, Pumpkin Roll, Red Currant Wreath, Salted Caramel Toffee, Scarlet Sunflower, Scary Good. I loved that last year. I'm glad it came back. I didn't put that in my club, but I'm glad it came back. Silver Bells. Sips of Cider was new last year, came back. I really like Sips of Cider. I warmed yeah, that, that again. Really good one yeah, it, I, I warmed, loved it in the kitchen. Yes, it, it was so strong, the <laughs> concept too. Um, mm -hmm. I think it smells like tea, but with like like an orange spice tea or something. That's what I think it smells like. I mean, it could be cider, but I think it smells also like tea too. It's a really good performer. Uh, Snowberry, Squeeze the Day, Sunkiss Citrus. Uh, Sunkiss Citrus, to me, that's kind of summery, but okay. Vanilla Bean Buttercream. Velvet Moon, that's back new from last year. I loved it. Very snowy spruce, weathered leather. Everybody keeps saying, why do they bring back leather, leather back? Because they don't know of anybody that really warms that, that likes it. Uh, I don't know. We had it in the pods. It was so overwhelmingly strong in Brad's car in the pods. We had to take it off the thing, be, and off the even pod. Even after it. taking it out of my car for weeks, it smelled it just like lingered. that. And it, Brad would go into yeah. work and people say, why do you smell like leather? It would just <laughs> attach to his body. I'm like, I'm a leather daddy. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's just crazy. It was so strong. That was so strong. But it, it like, melts. Okay, so I melted it in the salon and it, it smelled really good, though. Everybody commented about how yeah. well it smelled when it you did melted. Say that. that was last year when mm -hmm. before we got our house, before we had the salon downstairs, and we booth rented, he warmed it at that salon last year. Mm hmm and it year. had the whole Early last year. lawn smelling like it but you said but it was everybody good. loved it yeah we still have the bar here but we haven't warmed it yet i've been afraid to warm it because it, that pod just scared me yeah it, it's really good when it melts it smells really good when it melts so well evidently people like it because it comes back every mm -hmm. catalog welcome home white amber and silk which i'm glad because i just warmed that too not too long ago and i liked it even better than i did last year when i warmed it 
and my mom wore that. She loved it too. I really like white amber and silk. White amber and teak, that was new last, or was it new last year? I can't remember, or was that another time? I can't remember, it is coming back. Uh, I don't, we've never had that. I smelled the tester. It smells very similar to mahogany teak wood from Bath & Body Works, and I'm not crazy about that. I used to like that back in the day, but I just got so burnt out and I don't care for it anymore. I know a lot of people are like that with that mahogany teak wood. To me, it smells a lot like that, so I haven't really wanted to try it, so I've never had that in the wax or in anything with Scentsy. And then winter, winter, winter berry apple tea is coming back, and that's really good. Okay, so now we're going to go over what did not come back that was in fall and winter catalog last year so be merry didn't come back very blessed did not come back blue sage and tonka didn't come back bright cider life didn't come back i was so upset about that because i loved bright cider life i had the hand soap the wax something else like car bar scent circle it was also good um I'm just so surprised that I didn't come back. I didn't put in my club because I thought I was going to come back. But even though some stuff, some different things have been in clearance and different things and people thought that maybe it wasn't going to come back because of that. Because sometimes when they have certain things in clearance, then they don't come back. But it's not coming back and I don't have it in my club, so I won't be having that for a while. Uh, cinnamon buttercream's not coming back. Clementine cupcake's not coming back. We actually have one bar of that right now mm -hmm. that we got. It's available right now in the spring summer catalog. So if you really like that, put it in your club because it's not coming back in the fall winter. Uh, Dancing Sugar Plums is not coming back. Fairy Tale Pumpkin's not coming back. A lot of people don't like that, but I kind of like it. It's got, it has like a licorice blueberry type of smell. I liked it, but it's not coming back. I think I have one or two bars of that still. Graham Cracker Crunch. Can't believe that's not coming back. That was another big one. That Bright Cider Life were the two that I really couldn't believe didn't come back. I just warmed the last bar of that in the kitchen not too long ago. Just warmed our last bar. And I thought for sure it was gonna come back. Because we were talking to our son Marco and he's like, I was telling him what we were warming. And I said, Graham Cracker Crunch. I told him it's got peanut butter and like Graham Cracker stuff in the notes. He's like, oh, don't tell Lexi, his girlfriend. And I said, oh, I think it'll come back. And sure enough, it did not come back. I should have had that in my club. It wasn't a complete absolute love, but I did really like it. But I probably would have put it in my club just because it's, it's such a good one though. Even though I'm trying to be strict in my club. Anyway, Harvest Blessings, that's not coming back. Hugging a Mug, not coming back. That was just okay for me. It wasn't Iced a big love. Ice Pine's not coming back. Ice Pine's not coming back. Brad like loves that. that. He loves a lot of the pine ones. Icicles and Evergreen's not coming back. That was in a brick last holiday season. Mm -hmm. We still have some of the brick left. But um, people say sometimes when they come out in bricks, then they don't come out in the catalog the next time. Uh, Orchard Apple and Spice is not coming back. Pomegranate Prosecco is not coming back. Pumpkin Chai is not coming uh, back. I liked Pumpkin Chai. Brad liked it. I didn't care for that. I didn't care for that because for some reason when I warmed it, it, was, it made me cough. It made my throat scratchy. I don't know why. I... My throat was scratching. I felt like I needed a cough. I don't well, know. We something... could warm it and I could sit here and do this the whole time we warm it. Maybe soothe my scratchy throat. Yeah. Something of some spices in there was just irritating my throat. And I wanted to like <clears throat> do this a lot. It was just messing with me for some reason. It wasn't a bad scent. It just, I don't know. The spices just didn't agree with me for some reason. Spiced Ember Glow. That was another one. I really loved that one. That was so good last year. I would have loved for that to come back, but it's not. Sugar Cookie. That, I think, was off and on before or something or other. Like, when we just joined, people said it was back and then it wasn't. And But then, like, I think it's still available. If you're in a club, you can put it as a brick in your club. Because we got a brick of it. Um, I'm assuming it's still going to be available for a brick in the in your club. But um, it's not going to be in the catalog. Tinselberry. That was good last year. We warmed it. It's got strawberry. Cinnamon strawberry. Some other notes, but I know it's got the strawberry and then the cinnamon, but that mixture of the cinnamon strawberry is really, really good. I really liked it. Toasted acorn and oak. Um, that's not coming back. I really like that too. That was really nice. Uh, vanilla cinnamon maple's not coming back and berry merry cranberry is not coming back. So if we write any of these off and they're in the catalog now, I suggest you get on and you put it in your club if you want it because yeah. otherwise you're not going to get it. 
There's the not only a, way to get it is through your club. Not very many. These are are available right now, though, mm -hmm. except for a few of them were. Right. I I don't think very many of those are available right now, actually, but except for that one. The one that I talked about what was the uh Oh gosh, what was it? Clementine cupcake. A cinnamon buttercream. Is that for available? I don't remember about cinnamon buttercream. Blue Sage and Tonk, I think, is. Well, there's a few, I think. But anyway, if it's still available right now, then just like you said, put it in your club because it won't be back. Mm -hmm. uh, at least for this fall and winter. Okay, now laundry. Um, they got some laundry clean and body products. So we have black raspberry and vanilla. It's coming back. It's in the laundry. Clothesline is in the laundry. Daydream Oasis is in the clean, like the all-purpose concentrate uh, bathroom cleaner and the counter clean. Fiji Flower is coming back in the laundry and also new in the Scentsy Fresh. It wasn't in Scentsy Fresh, but it will be this fall and winter. Uh, Fluffy Fleece is coming back in the laundry, which is our favorite. Mm -hmm. Oh, we love Fluffy Fleece. That's my favorite laundry. We that love it. in Jamie time, but I mm, guess a tough, tough tie between Fluffy Fleece and Jamie time is my favorite. But it's also coming back, or it's also coming out in Scentsy Fresh this fall and winter as well. Uh, Glacier Water is coming out in The Body, which is body cream, body wash, hand cream, and hand soap. That was really good. That was the August scent of the month last year. That was the first scent we warmed in this house when we moved here. It was in August mm -hmm. when we moved in last year, and I always remember that. I liked Glacier Water a lot, mm -hmm. so it would probably be good in The Body products. Jamie Time is coming back in the laundry and in the body. A couple of the bodies. Body cream, body wash. Johnny Appleseed is in um, the clean. Bathroom cleaner and counter clean. Just Breathe is in the body. Lavender Cotton is in the laundry. Luna's in the laundry and the body. Magnolia Linen is coming back in the laundry. Uh, Odor Out is just in Scentsy Fresh. And then Make a Splash is in the clean in the body. To me, that's more summery, but Mystery Man is just in the body wash. And then Pink Cotton is in the laundry. Scarlet Sunflower is new in the clean new products this year, spring is, or fall and winter. Squeeze the Day is in the clean products. Sunkissed Citrus is in the clean products. Vanilla Mint is coming back in the clean pro products. We had that in the counter clean. That was really mm -hmm. good. I like that. Vanilla Waves is going to be coming back in the body. And White Amber Antique is new in the laundry this fall winter. I don't know how, it's like I said, I'm not sure. That White Amber Antique, I don't know if I like that or not, but I need to try the Wax of Sea because I just, it just smells so much like mahogany teak wood. Brad likes mahogany teak wood from Bath and Body Works. I'm just, I'm not a super big fan anymore like I used to be. Okay, now. They have a uh, bring back my washer wrist will be coming back out. Limited time um, offer on September 25th. You had to vote for your washer wrist you wanted to bring back. So three winners were co coconut, cotton, shimmer, and ocean. We've never had any of those, but I've heard ocean is really good and shimmer I've heard is really good too. So excited to try those in the laundry washer whips. They have some uh, Monsters Inc collection is coming out. I can't show you the pictures though because we're not supposed to show licensed things in videos if it's not an actual real picture. This is just like screenshots. I think we're not supposed to show those so I'm not going to show that to you. Uh, but it's like it's got like a little warmer, little mini warmer with a little eyeball guy. I don't remember what he's called. Uh, and then I, I think is his name. Yeah. And then they have some Scentsy Buddies, a wax and a warmer. Really cute. That collection is coming out. They have a this is a breast cancer awareness. breast cancer collection. I believe I can show you this because it's not licensed. It's just got like a scent circle, a buddy, and a warmer, and like some bars right there. That's coming out. Had like a three pack of bars and fragrance flower and things like that. So they're doing the breast cancer awareness stuff, but I think that's just my opinion. There's all kinds of cancers out there, and I think they should have because every month is something different. Like um, November, I believe. Yeah, November is pancreas cancer awareness. So they could do like pancreas cancer and lung cancer and you know, all the others. Like we should all really support 
cancer. We've all, I know everybody has been hit by someone they love that has gotten cancer. So I think that's a very important thing. And I think we need to support that. And I think Sensi really needs to come out with every month, do something for every cancer to support. That would be cool. The cause for it. Something different. It, yes. Each and time. It's, yeah. And for it's. For different cancers. Yeah. And it's to help find research is what they use the money for to cure these cancers. Mm -hmm. That would be cool. Mm -hmm. You can put that into suggestions. Yeah. Because they have little sensi suggestions you can put in. Yeah. So this, I found this online, I thought I'd mention it here. It says Disney's Park. It said there's an all new interactive experience coming to Magic Kingdom. Smellifants on Parade will be family friendly search and sniff adventure in Storybook Circus presented by Sensi, the official home fragrance of Walt Disney World. Stay tuned for the relevant details. So it's gonna be some kind of like Smellifants on Parade, like search and sniff thing at Walt Disney World, That's I guess. Cool. And they're bringing back some Dumbo things as well. So they're gonna have a, a Dumbo new warmer, it has like elephants going around the outside of the warmer, and like a little carousel thing with the elephants going around. They gotta bring back a buddy, and they got a new scentsy brick, a new scent, which I'll get to in a minute. I have it here, but I forget the name of it. I'll talk about that in a second. We got these new holiday bricks. They're coming out, and they are in the shape of a Christmas tree. Super cool. Yeah, shape of a Christmas tree, and that's what it looks like on the back. I'll get to the sense in a minute of that. Uh, they got the laundry, like I already talked about. Arctic, no, what did I tell you? Uh, Arctic Kiss is coming out in the uh, Sensi Fresh and the washer whips and the laundry liquid. So that is coming out. And Arctic Kiss, I think that'll be really good in the laundry. I think we were talking about that last year because they were talking about different scents would be good in laundry and Arctic Kiss definitely would be good in the laundry mm -hmm. and the Scentsy Fresh. And they're bringing out a Autumn Road Trip in the dish soap and Counter Clean, mm -hmm. which dish soap is cool because they got rid of dish soap. So this, I believe, is going to be, I think it's in the Harvest Collection, I think, uh, the Counter Clean and the dish soap and Autumn Road Trip. And then... They have the laundry liquid and the white amber and teak that I just talked about. Uh, they have the laundry liquid and wash whiffs and dryer discs. And then uh, the glacier water and the body products, including the hand soap and the lotion and the hand cream and body wash. And then also for consultants, if you're a consultant, they are making improvements to the workstation. It says, uh, new search engine, you will get results even if you misspelled a word. LTO marketing images will also be in the news tab. Updated, updating contact info will be easier to save and see. You will be able to create own tags, easier to export and import contacts, and we'll be able to merge duplicates. So I think that'll be good because sometimes mm -hmm. when you try to look up certain things, it gets a little difficult. I, I think when you try to find out customers that order certain things and different things, sometimes that gets a little tricky. Maybe they're going to make that easier, so that's good. Uh, we got some pictures of the Monsters Inc. Can't show you that. We got the Dumbo collection. Soaring the Disney brick, Disney Dumbo brick is soaring high through the sky. That's what the Sensi brick is. And that's a new scent, but it's coming out in a brick, so that's pretty cool. They have new. A lot. What's that? There's a lot of the Harry Potter. Harry stuff. Potter, yeah, the Ring Out Harry Potter stuff is coming back again with new stuff. They have Hogwarts House mini warmers, so they have four different ones for each house, um, Gryffindor and all that stuff. Each one, and they all have the different colors and the mini warmers. So if you're a Harry Potter fan, you can look forward to that. They also have a new Harry Potter Sensi Buddy, which is actually Harry Potter himself mm -hmm. in the Sensi Buddy. Um, yeah, and the mini warmers have this Slytherin, Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, and Ravenclaw in the mini warmers. This is, I believe this here is the limited time offer uh, warmer. I had this, I think, further up my notes. It's a little snowman. It's glittery, and then the, I think it's the element warmer, because I think in the back it's got the little dish you put the wax in, and then the, it's just that snowman that glitters and shines in the front. And then also over here, I don't know where this is, what collections this is going to be in, because I haven't, I've only seen this picture, but I haven't heard anything else about it. It's those little Christmas trees that 
light up they used to have back in the day. My mom made one of these in her pottery class. She actually still has it. We have one we bought like at Walmart that's white, but they're really popular. They're the retro trees that have the little lights on them. This here, you can see it's an element warmer. You see you put the wax in the little dish behind it, but it's got that tree in the front. So that's really cute, cool to have a warmer like that. They have a Friends Central Perk Sensi collection coming out from the TV show Friends. That's actually coming out like next week, like August 7th. It's coming out real soon. Um, we just now found out about it though. It's got a little couch that says Friends on it, like the Friends couch, and it's got a little sign behind it. It says Central Perk and it lights up the sign. And then it has a Friends bar that's coming out. It's got, I think, uh, espresso, coffee, and coconut milk, I believe. So that'll be another coffee scent. So hopefully it's good because Perk Me Up, those from Bring Back My Bar was really good, but it was a little bit on the lighter side, I felt like, and didn't last long. So hopefully this maybe will be stronger and last longer. I love Friends. I'm yeah. super excited about this one. I think it'll be pretty popular. So that's coming out. And then we have the new, these are the holiday collection bars. The Cherries Jubilee, Vanilla Birchwood, Sleigh Ride, Cranberry Candy Cane, and Rum Plum Plum. Rum Plum Plum are the notes for, or the for this uh, holiday collection of new bars. We have um, oils for, we got pictures of them all, oils for the holiday collection too. is Holly Jolly Jingle, Soft and Subtle Cuddles, Good for Goodness Sakes, is the um, fourth one, or third one, third one, sorry. Uh, so they have a Sensepirations Wax Collection coming out November 13th. And it is Christmas Cottage Sensepirations this year. So they had the Vanilla Bean Buttercream last year, and then they had the Candy Cane, or the, uh, uh, what was it? The Vanilla Bean Buttercream, and then the, uh, yeah, the Vanilla Bean Buttercream, and then they had the uh, Mango Sensepirations collection. So now they're having the Christmas Cottage, and they're having Christmas Cottage, Christmas Cottage Mint, Christmas Cottage Wreath, and Christmas Cottage Cider. Those should be really good, because I love mm -hmm. Christmas Cottage, it's such, so good. It's, and then put, add that mint with it and wreath, and the, the cider one sounds really good. The cider and the mint one smells, sounds really good. Yeah, because uh, Christmas Cottage, had, I think it had orange, and then um, it was orange raspberry, and then um, Christmas Cottage has Valencia oranges, raspberries, cloves, and spices. So it's already got cloves and spice, but then you add the other one, the cider, so you have even more spices, and then the mint. mint. So that should be pretty good with that collection for Sensepirations. Then the Holiday Limited Edition warmer I, I showed you with the snowman, the element warmer. That is called Swirling Snowman, and it looks like it's available November 11th, it looks like. And then you'll also get a little ornament because it comes with the warmer, and then it'll have a little ornament too for your tree. Uh, Sensi Sense of the Season collection. The scents for that are Homestead Holiday, which is Blood Orange and Cinnamon, Freshened by Fur Needle. Sounds good. Peppermint Rush is Peppermint Sweet Vanilla and an Accord of Freshly Fallen Snow, Sugar Plum Berry, a Jolly Holly Brew of Spiced Citrus Peels, Evergreen Berries, uh, Sugar Plums and Cinnamon Sticks. Actually, those three are uh, returning. We never had any those. Homestead Holiday sounds good. We've never had it before, but I think I heard that's pretty popular. Um, yeah, we've never had, I don't think we had Purple Rush, but those are all coming back, but we're fairly new, so we haven't had them. And then the new ones are Caramel Praline Cakes, so that's good for the bakery lovers because they took a lot of bakery things away, so we've got a bakery scent there. And then uh, they don't have the notes for this one here. I think they're somewhere, but I don't have them right here. Uh, Frosted Winter Pine, so the one for Brad there. Mm -hmm. And then they have the, these are the scents for the bricks, for those Christmas tree bricks. Cozy Kitchen, warm up to a blissful batch of warm oats with brown sugar and spicy cinnamon swirl. Smells delicious. That was already, that's coming back as well, but we've never had it. Candy Apple is coming back. And then the other three are new. Forever Flannel, Holly Jolly Cider, another cider, I love cider. Orange Spice and Everything Nice, that sounds good too. I don't have the notes right here. They may be somewhere, but I don't have them here. Uh, okay, and then, so we got things that are coming out. August, you got the August 1st, Warmer Send the Month, Mountain Sky Pink Leather. Um, then you just have fall products, discontinued fall, 22 to 23 products. Uh, 
you got the Friend Sensei Collection that's coming out on, that's actually uh, August 7th. Uh, Monsters Inc. comes out August 21st. And then the spring catalog sale is August 1st, so a lot of the stuff I think will be 10% off in the spring summer catalog for August. Uh, then September, Scent Warmer of the Month. The first fall catalog is on the first. Harvest Collection is on the first. Mickey Mouse uh, Halloween Jack O' Lantern Warmer is on the first. The Villains, New Villains, I have. That's coming out. I haven't talked about that yet. New Villains Collections comes out on the 18th. Uh, Harvest Favorites Warmer Collection is on the 18th. And then October, you have the Scent Warmer of the Month on the first. The Pink Sensi Charitable Cause Breast Cancer is on December 1st. December 1st. December. I'm sorry, October. October 1st. October 1st, the holiday collection comes out. October 1st, Christmas with Disney, Mickey Mouse, and Minnie Sensi Warmer. That is also something new that comes out. October 16th, Christmas Favorites Warmer collection. And then October 16th, Holiday and Christmas Bricks will come out. And then in November, November 1st, November Warmer, Scent of the Month. And then also Scentsy Sense of the Scentsy Scent of the Sense of the Season comes out on the first. And also the limited edition Swirling Snowman Warmer and Ornament on the first of November. November 13th is the Christmas Cottage Inspirationist Collection. And then November 13th, Willy Wonka Sensi Wax Collection, which I have another picture. Awesome. I, I'll talk about that in a second, because I have another picture with the notes for the scents, not the notes, the scent bars. Uh, and then November 20th, Harry Potter Hogwarts Houses Mini Sensi Warmer and Harry Potter Sensi uh, Buddy. Okay, then they're having the Harry Potter Christmas at Hogwarts Sensi Warmer. I can't show you a picture, but it's really, really cool. It comes out October 23rd. So it's a, it looks like the Hogwarts Warmer they had before, but it's, it's like white. Mm -hmm. And it like... Very Christmassy. Yes, it's all white and it lights up when it lights up when you turn it on. It's got like a blue color in there in the white. Really, really pretty. It's really, really cool. Mm -hmm. And then we have the Willy Wonka Wax Collection, which is three different scents. Comes out November 13th. The scents Willy are... Willy Wonka, I love Willy Wonka. Yeah, Everlasting, go Everlasting Gobstopper is one. Fizzy Lifting and Violet's Turning Violet are the three scents. And then, of course, the Everlasting Gobstopper on the cover has a picture of the Everlasting Gobstopper from the movie. So that's really cool that that's coming out. And then we have the new Disney Villains collection. It's got the uh, Just One Bite Warmer, which has got an apple, and it's it's kind of, it looks like a green apple is kind of melting down onto, it looks like, it's just kind of melting down. <laughs> it's like, it looks like a skull, and then it's, you put the wax on the top on the apple, and then you can see like little uh, villains in the eyeballs and stuff. Really cool. And it lights up, and it's kind of orange color on the inside. Uh, you have the, uh, Ursula Sensi Buddy. Ursula Buddy is coming out. They have Wilted Rose Fragrance Flowers with the villains on the fragrance flower and they like turn really cool creepy looking colors. Like really like a, a fluorescent kind of purple with like black around the edge. It's really kind of creepy looking but they look really cool. Mm -hmm. Okay so and then we have some warmers. This is the Cherubal Cause Warmer. I uh, gosh, I can't remember the name. I'll get to the name in a second, but I can show you a picture. It's really cool. This is a warmer, and it's for foster care and adoption. So that's really cool because we used to be foster parents, so it's really cool cause there. And then, uh, let's see what else here. So now we have some pictures. I'm just going to flip through these and show you here. Jolly old Saint Nick. That's Sensi Warmer there. This is Snow Cute Warmers and a Mini Warmer. Those are really cute. And then next, we have this, uh, gosh, I can't read backwards. Fabulous. fabulous, fabulous Flurry Warmer. That's really pretty with the snowflakes. And the Snowed In Warmer. It looks kind of like, it's a house, but it looks, kind of looks like a gingerbread house, but I don't mm -hmm. think it's supposed to be. It's just like, kind of like a Christmas Village type of warmer. Um, this is a gingerbread man, the mini fan diffuser, or yeah, it's a, this is the tabletop fan diffusers right there. It's really cute. Then we have the, your, uh, the Yeti Sensi Travel Pillow and the little, um, Yuri. buddy clip. Yuri, Yuri, is that Yuri? Oh, Yuri. 
Well, it's Yuri. Yeti, That's Yeti. Yuri by the clip, and Yeti is the Sensi pillow there. Um, Noble and Bright Diffuser. They have a dif new diffuser, and then you probably be able to get it to also in just a shade. That's really pretty. Uh, the Retro Reindeer. It's really cute. Look at the little cute little reindeer. Really cute. Um, and then this is the scents for the uh, holiday collection. I already told you about those. We got the Santa Stitch Scentsy Buddy. is really cute. Really cute. It's got Stitch and it's got Christmas lights on him. Like sewn. It's not actually a Christmas on him, but it's like sewn on there. It looks like Christmas lights. And he's got a hat, but it's the bottom of the hat's coming out of his mouth. Really cute. Um, Christmas with Disney Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse warmer. So it's Mickey and Minnie Mouse on a sleigh. Mm -hmm. And they're like holding each other really cute. That's warmer. And then we got a um, Christmas camper warmer. It's a mini warmer. And then a glitter greetings warmer. Mini warmer. So they had the Christmas camper in the full size. Now they got a mini warmer you can plug into the wall or use a tabletop stand. So that's really cute. Uh, Frosted Gems mini warmer and Gretchen Gingerbread Bear Scentsy Buddy. Uh, Radiant Red Poinsettia Fragrance Flower. This is pretty cool. So they're bringing out lots of fragrance flowers. They're just going crazy with the fragrance flowers. It's awesome. They got poinsettias for the winter time. So that'll be cool. I believe I heard that it just gets more red the longer the wax gets absorbed. It gets more red, I guess, as the further it goes. The wax isn't colored, but somehow it just makes... I think I heard that. It gets red the longer, even though the... I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that, but I thought I heard that. I'm quoting you. Okay. And then we have the you holiday. Better not be wrong. The holiday wax, uh, holiday jolly jingle, soft and subtle cuddles, and good for goodness sakes. Which wax. I already oils. I already told you that. The sorry, the oils. I already told you about those. And then uh, the fall fairy tale pumpkin warmer. They're bringing back, but they also have a mini warmer as well. So that was this was out last year. But oops. Sorry. This. They're bringing it back this year, but in a mini warmer as well, right there. So that's awesome. Uh, they have the retro white truck warmer with pumpkin delivery lid. So this is cool. It's right there. Rhiannon, start your saving. That's there. And stunning sunflower fragrance flower. So. They also have for the fall the sunflowers in the fragrance flower for sunflowers. That's really, really pretty. Mm -hmm. They're just doing great with the sunflowers. And then, the, or the fragrance flowers, they have the fall harvest collection bars, which is cashmere leaves, Dutch apple bread. Sounds really good. Fall into love, forever fall, white pumpkin and driftwood. So it sounds like they're getting some bakery and more uh, slightly baker type of scents in the LTO collections, hopefully. Because there wasn't a lot of pumpkin and bakery in the 10 new scents, but it sounds like the LTOs are going to have more pumpkin and a little more bakery. So excited to hear that. And of course, when we get them, we'll get early access and we'll do videos and talk about the scent notes and talk about the scents more in detail when we get those. We're just kind of going over real quick what, what's going to be coming. Harvest Bounty Warmer. This looks pretty. It's pretty. It is. It's pumpkin. I like it. The white pumpkin with the lid there. It's really pretty. Um, Calvarita, they had the mini warmer last year and now they have a full size warmer this year. Get that out there. Oops, sorry. So that is really cool. And Barista the Bat Buddy Clip. So I heard this is, um, in the, it's a buddy clip. So you can hang it upside down, you can spread the wings out or put the wings in, and it comes in the fragrance of a gimme candy in that. Which the bees will already be in there, it just it'll just smell like gimme candy. And they have a Lumina pumpkin. This is really cool. It's like a little it looks like a pillow. It's just a pumpkin and then you can put scent packs. packs in it, which is really cool. Yeah. So you can just sit it anywhere or you can put it on your use it as like pillows on your couch or something or whatever. And it'll smell like whatever fragrance flower you have in there. Or scent. Scent back. 
Okay, then we have, let's see, the Disney Mick, Mickey Mouse Jack O' Lantern Sensi Warmer. Can't show that, but so it's, cute. it's really cute. It's got, it's a, a Jack O' Lantern with a Mickey Mouse, and it's got ears, little pumpkins as the ears. Yeah. And then it's carved out, this face is carved out, and you put wax on the top uh, where the little stem is. It has little pumpkins like around the neck part. Yeah. Excuse me. And then the new bar is Frightfully Delightful Scentsy Bar. And I remember, I read the notes and it's got like pumpkin and stuff in it, so it sounds good. So we got some pumpkin there. Um, then we got this Let's Get Batty Warmer and Chill and Brew Warmer. I really like the Let's Get Batty. It's got mm -hmm. bats all on there. Uh, the it. other one has got the little skeleton in there with the, like he's supposed to be in some coffee there in that little coffee trick or treat mug. Uh, we got the Witch O Lantern and the Spooky Stair Mini Warmer. The Witch O Lantern is really cool looking. I really like the Witch O Lantern. I have some other pictures in here that this shows it a little bit better. Happy Jack Tabletop Fan Diffuser. So that's Super just Super cute. Be yeah, perfect you, for an office. Yeah, you put your little pods in there. Then we just got some uh, the body care or the um, laundry scarlet sunflower dish soap that I already talked about, and this was the um, the other other ones I've already talked about. These, so I'm not gonna worry about that. Uh, and then we got harvest collection oils. We got beetles and blood orange, snake oil and cedar wood, and wolf spain and apple brandy in the harvest collection oils. And then a uh, we got hand soaps as well for the fall harvest collection. Autumn road trip, fall into love and velvet moon. Ooh, I'm excited about velvet moon and hand soap because I loved velvet moon last year in the wax. It was really good. Mm -hmm. uh, then we got the Scentsy Bricks and all this stuff. I talked about since the season, separations, the Dumbo collection, fall winter catalog. Um, we got the forest light warmer. There, that is new. That's on the cover of the catalog. It's really pretty. Um, Pond's Edge with the little cattails on there. And they get the Pond's, pod, Pond's Edge and Mallard. So that's a little Mallard warmer there. And you got the, I cannot read, Golden Meadow. I actually like that warmer. It's I have another mm -hmm. picture. It looks really pretty in another picture I have. Sedona warmer. Verve. It's like one of those bright color, different bunch of different colors on that warmer. Emerald waves. If you like that kind of swirly kind of looking warmer. And these are called mods. They're like I think they're just simple warmers. They're just kind of simple and more kind of a simple kind of a look if you want if you kind of want to go for that kind of a look heart to heart that is the warmer for the uh, foster care adoption that we showed you and i think that's it and they just they talk about they show pictures of the new 10 new spring and summer scents or fall and winter sorry um we will be getting those early and then we when we get those we'll be ordering those on the first of august we'll get them towards the middle of august when we get them we'll first sniff with do first sniffs with you and go over the notes and all that stuff and i think that's almost oh we got some new oils regular oils not the harvest or holiday collection they're catalog oils i think white peach and eucalyptus orange blossom and cashmere and mahogany and oak and uh oh, yeah. there's new buddy clips text the t-rex and leone the leopard Sensi Buddy Clips there. Kind of sad because we wanted Nash, his room was done in dinosaurs and stuff, so I'm going to have to get that clip for for Nash. Put it in my car. Yeah. yeah we've got him all kinds of dinosaur clothes and everything. Yeah. Then uh, Frankie the French Bulldog, Sensi Buddy, is new as well. It's cute. And I think we're getting close to the end. Cheetah Mini Fan Diffuser. That was actually in the July with yeah, box, I think was it? it was the July. June, July. June I think or it was, July. I think it was July. Box. Or was it? No, I think it was June. June or July, one of the two. So that was kind of like, I thought that came out 
in years before, but I guess I hadn't. But it was new. It was like a little sneak early access thing you got because it was getting ready to come out in the fall and winter catalog. Oh, tabletop fan diffusers. They also have a tabletop fan diffuser. Two different ones there. So you, it kind of, it'll be kind of like the Sensi Goes, but it's like prettier. So you can just set it out somewhere and it'll look more, a little more decorative, decorative than a Sensi Go. You'll probably charge it and then put your pods in there. And like if you go on vacation somewhere and you just want to sit it out. Um, yeah, already talked about all this. Uh, they have some uh, returning, I forget what they call these, like the returning favorite warmers, holiday favorites or whatever. They have a Cardinal, they're bringing that back. That was out last year in the holiday favorites and it's coming back. They have the Happy Holidays warmer there. And a special delivery light, lid with lights. So it's that white truck again that said pumpkins and the harvest, like the harvest one, it has a tree, Christmas tree with lights. And Jolly right there. And Heavenly. It's got the angels on it there. Okay, and then lastly we have these. Uh, these are like kind of like Thanksgiving type of warmers. I, they're bringing these back. I believe these have been out before. Tom the Turkey. I know I've seen this before. And I thought it was really cool for Thanksgiving. It's really pretty Thanksgiving warmer. Tom the Turkey. And then we got the Scarecrow. That could be fall or Thanksgiving, either one. And then, um, well, this is Halloween. Fright Night Mini Warmer. I think these have all been out, if I remember correctly. Again, don't quote me on that either. But I think those are coming back. They've been out before. And uh, Yeah, I think that's it. That is it. So that's a lot of sneak peeks wow, right there. a lot. So, so much stuff coming out. So lots to look forward to this fall. Start saving season. your pennies. There's a lot of cool stuff. That's right. And of course, we'll, we'll do videos here and there about the collections. And if we're able to get certain things early access, like I said, we'll get them and then do videos and talk more about them when we get the collections in at a time. So just want to do that video, kind of give you a little, get, get you excited for fall and winter because it's going to be a good one, I think. They didn't have as much bakeries, but then I think they are doing a little more bakery in the LTOs. So, um, bakery and pumpkin, hopefully. All right. So, thanks for watching, and we'll see y'all in our next video. Bye. Bye, y'all.